Hi, my name is Gene Yuknavichus. I am a solution architect at Emerson. Sometimes our customers are limited where they can install their cabinets. Oftentimes these cabinets are outside, they have no active airflow for cooling, they're exposed in the direct sunlight, which preheats them up to 65, even 70 degrees Celsius. Emerson designs their industrial PCs and displays to operate in hot temperatures so that you can install them anywhere you need and don't worry about their performance. Focus on your application. Let's see how well our industrial PCs and displays operate in a hot temperature. Here we have a typical thermal chamber. And here you can see a large fan, which is used to circulate air inside the chamber. If we were to put our units inside such a chamber and perform a test, we would be testing under significant forced airflow conditions. Easy to pass the test and many other suppliers do just that. But this is not what the conditions inside the cabinet are. To simulate realistic conditions inside the cabinet, we need to block the airflow inside the chamber. For that, we first place another box here and then we put our RxI2BP industrial PC and RxI display inside that box. Now that there is absolutely no forced airflow around our units, we can perform a thermal test that reflects realistic usage conditions inside your cabinets. We load the CPU to 100% by using burn-in test software, set ambient air temperature to say 65 degrees, and see what happens. Another important point is that modern CPUs thermally protect themselves. When they get too hot, they slow down in a process so-called throttling. All these effects and frequency changes happens under the hood, and as a user, you don't really notice them until your application becomes sluggish, unresponsive, and perhaps you are starting to miss your real-time performance expectations. Many suppliers specify their processors in an operating temperature range in such a way that at the upper range of the operating temperature, the CPU is already throttling down. This is not what you want. What you really want is that industrial PC in a field operates and gives you the same performance as it did in the lab. Now back to our test results. As you can see, the chamber, the air around the units is at 65 degrees Celsius. The CPU is 100% utilized. The nominal frequency is 1.5 gigahertz and actual frequency is jumping close to two gigahertz and above. That's exactly what you want. Now let's try to raise the bar. Let's set the temperature to 70 degrees. Here I must note that RxI display is actually specified only up to 65 degrees C. So we going to violate the specification, but let's see what happens. Now you can see that ambient air temperature around the units is 70 degrees C. The processor remains 100% utilized. The nominal frequency remains 1.5 gigahertz and actual frequency is jumping up to 2 gigahertz. You get the full performance at 70 degrees Celsius with no active airflow. That's exactly what you want. Mission accomplished. In summary, Emerson industrial PCs and displays are designed to operate in the wide temperature range. No matter hot or cold, they will deliver you the full performance so that you can focus on your application.